Well, I bought another 555. Pretty sure it's a 555 anyway. I asked him uh, what was the stroke on the crank. He said he didn't remember. Seems kind of odd, but he had it. He's had it for a while. So here's the block. Got a bunch of oil in it because it's gonna sit for about another week or so till I get it to the shop. There's the crank. So got the uh, one of the pistons right here. Let me see if I can hold this phone just right. So got a pretty good dome to it. And it's been deburred. So all the sharp edges are uh, uh, gone. Yeah, it's used. He, uh, he made a number of passes with it. Took it apart. And he was going to put it together and run it again. But uh, his son... Unfortunately, got into drugs and whatnot, and stole the uh, stole the heads off of it. And so he said, "Screw it! I'm just gonna sell it." Here's the cam. It's uh, like 700 and something cubic in, or 700 and something inch lift. I don't remember what. I got the distributor for it. Push rods. Um, let's see. I got uh, a couple of starters for it, an alternator, Marnock balancer, and here's all the rods. Got some eagle rods. Let me turn it this way. So really good rods. Oh, let's see. He was running uh, these uh, copper shims for, or not shims, copper gaskets. Got the pan. So, uh, yeah, anyway. Um, oh, yeah, distributor. And also, it's a belt drive. <clears throat> belt drive instead of... Um, oops, hang on a second here. Belt drive in instead of a chain. And let me see here. Eleven seven forty nine is what the cam is. Yeah, anyway, I got a pretty good deal on all this. Oh, and I also have uh, rockers, rocker stands for this thing. So it's not just it's not just rockers. So roller rockers, the rocker stands. So yeah, I got a pretty good deal on all this. I think. Um, so I'm gonna take it to the shop, have it all cleaned up. And uh, put it back together. And and the guy that I bought this from uh, a couple days ago, he calls me up. Says, "Hey, by the way, I found uh, brand new rings and bearings for that thing. So um, I'm having my friend go over there and pick them up. He's he's like two hours away or more. <clears throat> the guy that I got this from. So my friend's gonna grab them. And then when I take this to the shop, I'm gonna pick them up, pick up the rings and bearings and everything, have them clean it up, make sure everything's really good, and put it back together. Then I just gotta find some heads." So, um, not sure what heads I'm going to go with, but, um, they're going to flow good and hopefully this will be a, uh, somewhere in an eight second, eight second, uh, range, depending on what car I put it in. Um, <clears throat> those pistons, he thinks they were like 15 to one pistons. So I'm going to try and figure that out because there's no part number on them. And so this car right here, this one has a 555 in it. And the previous owner, he was doing, he did some uh, 950s at 142, and um, it should have been able to do lower nines. And so my Black Nova, which are in some of the videos here on my YouTube page, it's in the car trailer over there. I'm thinking about putting this one in that and maybe run small tire for a while. So we will see. But I got to change the rear end and transmission and that thing to hold this kind of power that this thing's going to put out. All right, hopefully I'll be putting up a lot of more a lot more videos soon. See ya from Jay's Garage. Remember, hit that hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, and hopefully pretty soon I'll be putting on more stuff.